Hiya, welcome to your <laughs> Thursday this morning. And Josie is here. Oh, welcome back. Day three. Three days, I can't believe it. But yeah, I'm still thank enjoying you. it. I'm obviously I'm with you, but yeah, I'm really enjoying it and I've had a real good time. But um, what our viewers don't know is you're not only presenting the show, you're driving the show, but you're also teaching me as well. And you've done it so smoothly that I doubt even anybody at home has known. So well, you're very sweet. I, I cannot didn't need to thank... do any of that because you're brilliant. No, so I that's funny. No. I've got to say good morning to Holly. Uh, I texted her this morning and, uh, and so she is uh, much improved from her stomach bug, uh, but, uh, but still not quite there, but she will be by Monday. But, uh, well, but I hope she's so. had a proper rough time of it. I know, and there's only so much I can wing it for, so hurry up and get back, Holly, <laughs> all right? <laughs> oh, well, clearly someone likes me because I've been presented with a plate of mince pies this morning. Mm. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Uh, these aren't just any mince pies. Apparently, they're the mince pies this Christmas to have, the best mince pies. In a survey conducted by consumer group Which, these are luxury pies by Iceland, one in both... There you are, tip it up for you. One in both flavour and also in value. There you are. So, let me just give you a little bit of information on them here. Uh, and this was a, a blind taste test conducted by 66 shoppers. Iceland's luxury all-butter mince pies came out joint top with Tesco's finest and the co-op's irresistible range, but at a price of only £1.89, Iceland's mince pies are the best value at 11p cheaper than Tesco or co-op. So, let's cut into it I'm... very early on. Oh, look, now that, that for Juicy. me... Yes, is a good ratio of pastry yeah. to filling. All right. That's important. What do you think? Oh, wow. Phil. Ooh, I love good the fact... flavour. Mm, I love the fact that Witch have conducted this on a mince pie. Witch have got it so right. Mm? They are really good. Well, really they seldom juicy. get it wrong there. Well, sometimes when you go for a cheaper option, yeah. they're a bit dry, aren't they? Yes, and it's not dry. It's no. moist. There's a little bit of booze in there. Very, mm. very fruity. Nice. We love it. Well we done. love it. Are we a nation of hoarders? I'm a bit of a hoarder, I've got to be honest. I was a hoarder, and then you realise just how much space it takes. Well, yeah, so... What do you hoard? Um, I, I get addicted to buying really weird things. I'm, I'm not going to... Right, we're on TV oh, now. Oh, no, you are. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what really weird things? Calculators. <laughs> 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 I know, it's, it's the oddest thing ever, yeah. Wow. I just, yeah, yeah, anyway. Moving on, yeah, are we, a, are we a nation of hoarders? I know I am. Phil, you're not. I don't, I don't think so. I mean, I save, if people give me notes or letters or things like that, <laughs> I save things like that. I mean, I love a bit of stationery. Um, and I'll, you know, I'll go that far. You know, I, I, I like having envelopes and I always I like having that. stamps and I, you know, all of that sort of business. I like a good pen. But oh, hoarding, yeah. no, no, not really. Camilla? Can I have one of your calculators, Josie? Because my son <laughs> was saying I was meant to have got one at the beginning of the September term. <laughs> Mum, where's the calculator? I keep on forgetting. So, can oh. I, have you got a scientific one that would suit a year seven child? Because I'll have that if you don't know. I've got a massive stash, so I'm sure I can give you one, Camilla. How many yeah, have you no got? Problem. Well, it got is it would turn into a bit of an addiction, Phil, all right? Let's 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 just leave it there. How many have you got? I wouldn't like to say. There's too many to count. And then bathroom Well, you scales. can use a calculator. <laughs> 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 um, anything else? Um, bathroom scales. <laughs> <laughs> can we just stop there? But they're because big! It's weird, I know. They're yeah, big! I know. What, like, on top of each other? Well, I've, you know, had a bit of space under the stairs now, so, um, yeah. That's put... Is it what is it? Is it the design of them or? I just think, oh, I like them, and then I don't think I got enough of them, and it's all in my head. It's weird. Really? Yeah. Well, there right. you are. So now we know I'm a weirdo. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> I think what they really ought to do, though, is make an advent calendar that is uh, filled with calculators and... Uh, <laughs> bathroom scales. And bathroom scales <laughs> as well. Or you could just get a calculator and every day you could just go, there you go, one plus one equals two. There you go, that's your day two. And then you could go plus one How's equals How's that making two. you feel? Steve, I haven't got that one. Can I, can, can I get You're it? You're joking. Can I get that one? Yeah, of course you can. Oh, thank ah, you. Merry Christmas. She told me in the break after we talked about the fact that she is, hoards calculators is it's a bit of a nightmare because occasionally she has to take them all outside so that the sun charges them up again because many of them are solar powered. Is that true? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's brilliant. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, Steve, thank you very thank much. Thank you so thank much, you, guys. Steve. Well done, thank Josie. You. Absolutely amazing. Well done, you. Amazing week. Round of applause. Well done, you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.